What's up y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm be going on my college visit and I'm going to be taking y'all with me. I'm gonna be showing y'all what they show me and we're gonna have a good time. And I'm super excited because this might be where I'm going to college. Well, this is like my first choice. So I'm excited to see all the things that they show me. And yeah, I will see y'all when we get in the car and get to the campus. Y'all ain't know how I like it though. You're right. You did. I know y'all didn't know. My person phone. I'm you like. ain't know how to lock the door. Is your person phone still there? Mm. Yeah. That's okay. Y'all is funny. We're only like 10 minutes away. Early, so we're like 30 minutes early, so yeah, this thing is bag with a shirt and a book in here. And the shirt's actually kind of cute, so I'm gonna be wearing it. I forgot to show y'all my feet, so I'm gonna show y'all now. Um, blue sweatshirt. Perfect. Say hi. <laughs> First thing that they did, they took us all in this room and showed us this presentation video of student life and what the school was all about. And it was a pretty nice video. It made me like actually want to go there even more. And she basically is just telling us about mission and financial aid and all that extra good stuff. After the video presentation, they separated us into groups of three. And my group started, we went to the student union first, I believe. Or was it the library? I'm not sure. But um, we went there. It was pretty cool. I liked it. It's basically like the cafeteria, but like also a place for like students to just like yeah I guess I don't know I'm not really sure but I think it has a lot of food places in there so and I liked how it was spacious it was very 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 spacious so you won't be like cluttered and it had like different levels so that was cool too so you have to be all next and cluttered to people and this is a lobby he was just explaining to us like and just showing us student life <laughs> freaking group had to wait for her because she had to go to the bathroom. So cold out here, my ears. My ears are hurting. They're hurting? Yes. We're ready to be let into the door. dorms these right here are the sweet style dorms which means they have the private room and private bathroom and i didn't really like those but 
this building right here has the traditional um, dorms with a community bathroom, which I do not want at all, but I love the rooms and like the kitchen and all the extra stuff. Like the room is really, really cute, but I think the bathrooms are just a deal breaker for me. Um, this is the room where like people can go like to hang out, you know, just like a room to just like talk to people. I don't know. After we seen the dorms, we went right across the street to the gym, which was super convenient for me because I like to go to the gym a lot, so I thought that was pretty cool. Um, it was very spacious in the gym. They also had rock climbing, which I thought was dope because I've never seen rock climbing inside of a gym before. And the footage is super short because it said no recording allowed, so I tried to get as much as I could. And I think I got pro lifers in the middle of the campus. This I just said abortion is a murder. Oh, okay. So I just had an appointment with the Spears School of Business. I realized that I didn't get that much footage of the Spears School of Business basically because I had a separate tour, but I was locked in this time. Like I was not thinking about vlogging at all. Like I wanted to soak in all the information because if I was to go to that school, that's where I'm gonna spend most of my time. So I wanted to learn, I wanted to learn as much as I could about the building, of course. If that's where I'm gonna be, I don't wanna be looking lost. I feel like it's the coolest building on the campus probably because that's the only building I actually like went inside and like know everything about but um like the generic tour it doesn't allow you to go inside the classrooms you basically just know where all the buildings are and you know like where the dorms are where the cafe is the library like all the essential stuff that you need to know right and it tells you like where the hospital is, the safety, like the buses, all that stuff. I guess we'll start with like what the building looks like. Basically the building is literally in the shape of a hook. The newest building on campus, like it was just built and it has four floors. Like looking at it from the outside, it does not look like it has four floors at all. There's a first floor, there's a second floor, and there's a third, fourth floor, but there's a basement. So I guess the basement is considered the first floor. But the basement, it doesn't feel like a, a basement. Like it's literally, like it looks the same. Like generic tour takes you through there, but you don't really get to see like everything. Like it just basically just take you through this end, walk you and through the, out the other end. That's basically it. But when I went on my second tour, I got to see like more in depth of what the building was actually like. So on the first floor, there's this classroom in the shape of like a, a globe kind of. It's super cool. It's like glass around it. It's like all glass. There's like lights on the ceiling and it has like three projectors. It fits 50 to 60 people. So that's on the first floor. And then when you're walking in the halls, there's these lights. That's, that's like kind of like the one that's in the classroom. There's these lights on the floor that like projects the natural light to the basement. So the basement isn't dark. So I thought that was pretty cool. As you're walking, there's this lobby that's in the first floor. They, um, they throw events in there. It's kind of like a study place for like all the Spears students. Um, it's just like, just for Spears students to study in. Like, of course you used to study in like the library and all that stuff, but like just for business students, they could come in there and study. It's where they throw events with like the professors. She said it's called professors out of classroom or something like that i don't know it's basically when the professors come and all the students come and get all the business students come and get free pizza i think that's it for the first floor the first floor oh they also have this it's called planet orange it's like this cafe um and they have starbucks like i guess the one the woman was telling me that 
they the school asked what the students want and they said that they wanted Starbucks inside of the building. So they got Starbucks. So that's pretty cool. Like, after the first floor, we went down to the basement. And so in the basement, they have these like little pods. They're like little study areas. Of course, there's still the study area upstairs in the lobby that I already showed y'all. But there's like the little pods where you can go in and shut the door and it's like super private. The classrooms, the classrooms are downstairs in the basement. I know that sounds pretty weird, but like they're really nice. The first one that she showed me was the big, the, the one of the bigger classrooms, but it fits about 175 students. And it's like in a curved type of classroom, like it with levels kind of, I don't know, I'll show you a picture. And it has like three projectors. It looks super cool. They were actually in class um, while we were there. So I got to see like the students actually in class she showed us one of the smaller classrooms too i think she said it fits about 50 55 to 65 people i don't i don't remember but one of the accounting classrooms they they have like whiteboard desks that they can literally write equations on and erase it like that was pretty cool and the desk they like move up and down whatever height you want it she showed us another classroom i don't really understand the concept of the gray desk she said that the front part comes off for like group work and you can like move around i don't know something cool something's cool about the gray desk but i didn't really understand what she was saying but they have those type of classrooms too um that one's also a smaller classroom it fits about 75 people i think 75 people is a big classroom but i guess not compared to 175 so that's the basement the second floor has more classrooms up there like the first floor is like where you come in, da 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 da. The basement where the study pods and some classrooms. We when we went back up, we skipped the first floor and we're back up to the third floor, I guess. There's more classrooms and the fourth floor is where all the professors' offices are. So I think that's pretty cool to have like every business professor in the building um, at one time. I mean, they might not be all in the building at one time, but like you know where their office is at, you know. If I was to go there, that's where I would spend most of my time. So I think it's a good place to spend your time. Like it it was it was nice. It wasn't like dirty or anything. Like it wasn't, you know, like someplace you like ooh, don't wanna go. Like you like it didn't feel like a place that I would dread going to, you know? Like it felt like a good environment. So if I was to go there then I feel like I would enjoy my time there. Finally made back home. Um, this floor was amazing. I hope you guys got to kind of experience the trip with me. I tried to record as much as possible, but like some places you couldn't record, which is understanding because privacy of the students. So I hope you guys got the kind of experience that y'all were there with me. Um, cause that's what this video is about. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next one.